I would say that in patients who have repeat cancer, they've been through remission and now the cancer is coming back, quite often they have to have more and more uh, chemo, diverse types of chemo and higher doses of the chemo so that eventually you get to the point where the side effects of the chemo become so debilitating that the patient would rather die and doesn't work any longer. Pawpaw can help to prevent that from happening because pawpaw kills resistant cells. It kills resistant cells better. Even in the cockroach study that we did, we were able to kill pesticide resistant cockroaches with some of the pawpaw compounds at one fifth the concentration that it took to kill the normal cockroaches that didn't have any resistance. So the same is true with cancer cells. And the pesticide resistance, incidentally, is an ATP dependent uh, process as well, just like cancer cell resistance is multiple drug resistance in cancer is ATP dependent. So it makes sense to give pawpaw in these cases and let's keep those doses down and, and we can help patients by helping to alleviate some of those devastating side effects of the chemo and keep them alive longer, which is what it's all about, with quality of life without being sick. You're so sick you might as well